the, the L, I'm gonna go back to F, that that F B. How do you say his name again? F Y F Y B J man. F Y B J man. This Oop cereal is it's it? It's called where, where, where can you get them at? Uh, you have to buy them online. They're a hundred dollars a box. Y'all, man, you know, and, and people it, buy them. Yes. Did, Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Came out. And then he went even right 30 back days. in. Not even 30 days. And, and now he mad at his family because they didn't go to... Yeah, yeah. It's the court day. Niggas, man. What you, <laughs> niggas think the world revolve around them, bro. Just hating it, man. But you would think that people, especially if you bro, niggas, to prison... Like I told y'all earlier, life go on, man. People got bills. People got to eat. The world getting crazier, more dangerous. I'm not about to go to keep going to this nigga. Man, I signed the artist and I told him. I, I, there was this one Dallas artist I signed. He was nice. And I met him at the I met him in Juvenile when okay. I went to go talk to him yeah. with Trap Boy. Yeah. I met him. He was super nice. Super dope. I signed him. I told him and his mom. I looked him in the eyes. I said, if you go back to jail, I'm not bailing you out. Mm. I said, I'm not bailing you out. He went back to jail. I bailed him out. <laughs> he went back again. I'm not bailing you out this time, bro. Why do you think they can't learn their lesson? Ego, pride, anger, disappointment. Like they, they disappointed in themselves. They hate, they mad at their position. They like need counseling. Counseling. They the the household. Mm -mm, I ain't and, and just to my point with honeycomb. Nah, bro. Like. Mm -mm. Do you think it's he gonna ever come out and become be? No. Nope. Nope. You think he's done? It's too easy to trick him off the street. If honeycomb get out of jail. You could be a rapper and say, fuck you, nigga. Fuck you and your whatever happened to your family. He going to crash out. It's easy. These niggas make it easy, bro. Wow. It's it's easy. It's easy to get these niggas out, out the way. It's you, easy. It's super easy. You can say any words get to all these people. Wow. Word get to everybody. You just said you don't read the comments that's because why I don't, of that. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> words get to me. We're human. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, who? Because it's like, who the fuck you think you is talking behind a keyboard like that? Like, who you? I'm not the toughest guy in the world, obviously, but who are you? Willie D had a verse say, you, they got, I catch you in person, I'll break your fingers. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Willie D was hard on that verse. That was, that was on one that, that uh, he was talking about quitting the South verse. Yeah. You know, like, that, the uh, F, FYBJ Maine. This dude, man, like, you you and him connected. Mm -hmm. I only seen him through you. Mm -hmm. Like, did you, when you first started dealing with him, did you know he was going to nah, like at that? at first, Victoria kept hitting me up about him, and I'm like, who the fuck is this? Because he kept dissing King Von, and like I told y'all, I don't really like that. Like, I get if you, like, poke at people and shit like that, but he, like, kept using King Von, like, dissing King Von. But as I, like, got to know him, he kind of, like, found himself in... He caught a niche with his, it hit different and the phrases and the serial whoops. And whoops, yeah. He just gave uh, my whole basketball team whoops, so they I were seen happy. your basketball team. I was going to ask you about that. Top 10 in the them. nation. I seen wow, it with the, the same cheese yep. logo on the shorts, yep. man. Yeah. Congratulations, yep. man. So that, different stuff like that I like doing, you know? Yeah, I see I hardly that. put that on my page and stuff like that, but I do a lot. I try to do a lot for the community. As you should, like, because you God has feed, blessed the, you. I go downtown, feed the homeless. Whenever we throw big parties, like fight parties, um, when there any leftover food, we, me and my girl, we always go down there and just give them whatever we got. That's that's it. Um, never we never put it on a, uh, on Instagram, yeah. like, cause that's not what it's for. But um, it, and it it feels good too, just to see they smile and they're so grateful. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like, cause I'm so used to dealing with people who ain't shit, who no, don't, who real. don't even say thank you. Man. So yeah, that. Have so, you ever seen a homeless person like that? Because when you give it to them, do you ever stand up and like hear their story and talk to them? I need to do better with that. Because I feel like we treat we treat homeless people like like they dogs. Mm -hmm. Like, have you ever been at a red on a bad day? You've been at a red light and you just didn't even want to look at them. You just look straight because <laughs> you didn't want to make eye contact. Right. It's like damn. Like and everybody do that. Everybody don't want and then and then they start to feel invisible and then they start to feel worthless. So that's right. You're right about that. Yeah, because wow. I would love to hear some of because some of these and people. Would I be wrong to go downtown and inter, and do interviews? No, you wouldn't be. That would be some would dope that, interviews. Because they do that in Philly, in yeah. Kingston, where the uh, the, the uh, where they where people be shooting the heroin and they be hearing their story. They be paying them. Wow. That be is that is that bad to do? No. 
I don't. It, it, I don't it, feel that way. I don't know. But like, I wouldn't I pay know, them. It could, but I wouldn't pay them. When I say I wouldn't pay them, yeah, because they go buy more drugs. Exactly. I'm the type of person that I'd be like, okay, what do you need? Mm. You hungry? I'm gonna go buy you some food. Do you um this this, this food place right here? Do I need to pay for a month worth of food? Mm. And you go over there and get lunch Damn. every day. You see what That's I mean? Dope. I'm gonna get with somebody in the city, and we what we gonna do? We gonna get we gonna get a few homeless people, and we're gonna we're gonna get um. We're gonna get their hotel for 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 a month or wow. like a week. Wow, that's dope. Wow, that's, yeah. You see what I mean? Damn, that's that just touched me. Yeah, because I feed them and I don't talk to them. Yeah, damn, and they regular people. Because I've met, yeah. we met. I remember the time when we met this lady at Yoke. And she works in there. She said she was telling us her story because we talked to everybody. And she was saying she was homeless at once because her husband, who was rich, whatever, ended up putting her on drugs. Mm. And because he wanted her out of the way. So yeah. put her on drugs and she ended up being homeless under the bridge or whatever. And she only had one Bible that she would always read. And that's, that's what helped her get clean and get out of it. But just to hear her story and the things that she went through and Damn. where she was, she was up here. You understand what I mean? And to know that you can be up here and ended up under the bridge. Mm. You understand what I mean? Yeah, my girl, she keeps in touch with this homeless lady. Um, and when the homeless lady lady needs uh like um Sanitary she needed stuff. she needed a bigger suitcase to store her stuff in mm -hmm. and my girl went and and gave it to her. But but when you ask me that, it's like, damn, I really don't be talking to them. Mm -hmm. I just I just go ahead and get out the way because I don't know if they're gonna try to like you know yeah yeah I, like, I I I think I think you you just you got to go with the spirit to move with God yeah. Yeah. yeah like what what do you think like the, the L, I'm gonna go back to F that that F B how do you say his name again F Y F Y B J man F Y B J man this Oop cereal is it's it called where, where where can you get them at uh, you have to buy them online they're a hundred dollars a box. Y'all, man, you know, and, and people did, buy them. Yes. Did, was you there when when he came up with that? Was you? Or did I you, wasn't there. No, I wasn't there. But it's like you almost introduced me to him. You helped his brand yeah, a lot, bro. Yeah, for sure. Like so, he blew up quick. Like yeah. like like. I was trying to figure that out. I'm like, these platforms, you really can take somebody and yeah. make them. And the same thing with anybody. Like, if you can believe, like. Um, you know how Vlad has Boosie and Correct. and all them different people, and if it's somebody and y'all bond well, and and the numbers go up, shit, yeah, put, put them on the contract or, you know, look out for them and shit. That's hard. Yeah. I, I just see him moving. He over was there. homeless too, uh, but he, he, yeah, he. But this is public though. He went online and he was homeless, homeless. And one day I um I picked him up. Uh, he was at a U-Haul. He was about to move. He had his last money. I picked him up and uh, I said, "Here, bro." I gave him, I gave him a good, good amount of money. I said, "Bro, this is for two interviews, but you better not run off on me." Mm -hmm. Real shit. I said, "This is for an interview, the next time, next month." And uh, so that money got him to where him and his family could. Wow. Yeah. Then he end up with That's Cardi cool. B or something. I seen him. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. This nigga was moving. I said, this uh -huh. boy here. I said, he moving. And he, yeah. and, and like I said, you only going to see more people like that. Yeah. Like, how do you know who to pick and who? Bro, like she just said, like y'all just said, when I, when I picked him up at the U-Haul spot, it's just, when he got in the car, it was good energy. Mm. It was his, it was good, like, just good energy. And I was just telling to my, I was just telling myself, I'm a, I'm going to help this kid, man. I'm going to help this dude. And then, um, I just, I hand him the money and he was like, bro. And ever since then, we've been locked in. Wow. I got a now he interviewing people. In, I, in see him. So I see him. I see him. Yeah, like, Didn't just, he do one with Ray? I know you and Ray and him did one together. Yep. Didn't they do one by themselves? Nah, me and Rain did. Oh, they did. They did. Yep, he interviewed Rain. Yeah, yep, that's yep, what yep, I, yep, I, yep. I remember that. Yeah, me and Rain, me, him, me, him and Rain interviewed did 600,000, I think, something. 700,000. Wow. I got to get him in here one day. That'd be cool. Yeah, yeah, that'd be he has cool. a real story. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah like he, outside the funny shit, he has a real story. No, he's. I hear good things about him. Yeah. I hear that off camera, he's real. Like he not even like all the way like that, but he's real like a respectable yeah. dude. From what I hear, mm -hmm. I just go by what people tell yeah. me. He's know? a real good dude. Yeah. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.